Hello there! Let us talk about our material and waste footprint and what we can do about it. As a society, we use heaps of materials all the time. Concrete and steel for buildings and infrastructure. Fossil fuels for energy supply and plastic products. Biomass for food production. Metals and minerals for many other products. The average Australian has a material footprint of about 40 tons per year, 4-0. That's four times larger than the global average of 10 tons per person per year. All of these material flows create environmental impacts and many of our products become waste. On average, we recycle only about one third of our waste. In this module, you will learn about two concepts that try to minimize our waste footprint. Industrial ecology and circular economy. So what do they mean? In industrial ecology, we try to learn from natural ecosystems on how to deal with waste flows. After all, these natural systems have done it for many millions and sometimes even billions of years. Understanding how they do this can help us design more sustainable industrial systems, where the waste of one industry becomes a resource for another industry. And then we have circular economy. Circular economy is a very similar concept, but focused more on products rather than industries. The idea is to keep products, components and materials circulating in use for as long as possible through long-lasting design, repair, reuse, remanufacturing and recycling. The ultimate aim is to minimize the amount of resources we consume and the waste we generate. So, as you can see, this is much, much more than just recycling waste. In fact, recycling is actually not the preferred option of how to deal with waste, because it needs energy and resources on its own. Rather, we are talking about a completely new model of industrial production, which involves designing products so they don't become waste in the first place, so they last longer, so they can be repaired and upgraded, so they can be reused or resold, and so that materials can be used in remanufacturing. Both these concepts, industrial ecology and circular economy, are aiming to achieve what we call a restorative process, where materials and products can be reused many times. A good example of such a transformation is the take-up of prefabrication in the construction sector with machining off-site. This allows for almost zero waste production of building components, easy retrieval of materials and components, and building elements that are easy to reuse when the building is being demolished. Working towards zero waste has become a worldwide movement and we want you, as the engineers of the future, to become part of that. Thank you.